Benjamin Diver, thank you for coming to the Snowflake offices today. Hey, no, thank you so much for having me here in San Mateo. It's, it's a pleasure to be here. Really excited to be able to talk to you about the exciting things that we've developed in our partnership with Snowflake. Yeah, this is a super interesting partnership because so many Snowflake customers have asked me how to move data from their SAP to their Snowflake account. And you have good news for us. Yeah, absolutely. It's uh, We've got some really exciting uh, development to share. Um, what we're going to talk about today is a product from SNP, which is SNP Glue, and specifically about the SNP Glue connector for SAP, which is a, a Snowflake native application. And what makes this SNP Glue special? Oh, so what we have is a product that's going to be able to push data from the SAP NetWeaver stack. We're going to be pushing to Snowflake on our own Snowflake connector and then being able to make sure that the data is immediately available for reporting and we manage the consumption of the data into Snowflake and then consolidate and merge it together all in one fell swoop behind the scenes, totally managed by SNP Glue. A native app that streams data. Do you have a demo for us? Absolutely. It's, let's go ahead and get into the demo now. So as you'll see, we're jumping into an SAP system. So SNP Glue is an add-on to the NetWeaver stack. Now, as we jump into this, what you're going to see is that the entire solution resides within its own namespace. We use standard best practices for our development patterns. We store and consolidate all of the development objects inside of underlying packages and folders, again, using standard best practices for development in the ecosystem. Now, one of the things I mentioned earlier is that we really look at this as an extract and load pattern. What you're seeing up on the screen right now in our orchestration layer, there is a full-fledged transformation layer that is available to you if needed. So that is capable. You can see that we're pulling across metadata from the underlying NetWeaver stack. And then as we jump forward, we're looking at the development objects right now. But as we jump into this, what's also important is to note, how do we actually connect to Snowflake? Remember, this is being driven from the NetWeaver stack. And so, as we open these, these folders up, you can see our Snowpipe streaming connection as we jump into this. This is very standard SAP administrative tasks and very standard connection details that you would use for connecting to a Snowflake account. There's nothing in here that is going to cause any underlying issues within our, our various systems. So as we're jumping in, inside of our Glue ecosystem, you've got our scheduler. I've got a scheduler that's running right now that's basically streaming data up into Snowflake via the Snowpipe streaming API. Right now I'm pulling up these requests. You can see in here, data is being generated as those little boxes turn green, you know it's being delivered. And so what you're seeing is that these are sub-second run times, hundreds and thousands of records are being delivered, but they're being delivered in this incremental ongoing basis and flowing up to Snowflake. And so as we're watching this data get generated, and it will continue to be generated, now we can start flipping over to the actual Snowflake landscape and looking to be able to see, okay, let's see how the data is processing and, and coming into Snowflake. So we're going to start off by looking at a dashboard. This dashboard is going to show us what's going on behind the scenes as the native app is running. So this dashboard is showing us, okay, we have a Delta count. That's our staging table that's coming in. We have a main count. That main count is that main consolidated data set. And then the view is consolidated. Now what you just saw was the Delta drop down, the main increased, that consolidation event ran in the background. There was no performance degradation. The view maintained stability. The data was reportable the entire way. We never saw any huge draw on system resources. And so we never had any loss of fidelity or access to the data. The native app is doing that in the background for us. And as we jump into the native app, we'll jump through the Snowflake front end. I'm pulling up the native application right now. You can see that we're you know, just jumping through the steps for the native app to start up and we'll be able to see what the actual configuration settings look like in it. So as the merge user interface is coming up, you can see we have five merge tables, five are active. There's really not a whole lot of configuration need to do. Right here, we have a warehouse, some suffixes, and the schedule. Those are the only pieces that you actually really need to configure. The rest of this is all automatically controlled through the SNP Glue ecosystem. So we're not kidding when we tell you how easy it is to set this up and make it run. Really quite simple. 
Now we're back to our dashboard, and the dashboard is simply showing the progress of the app. Again, in our main table, we're up to 60,000 rows of data where our delta is continuing to increase. And remember, our native application is running on about a one minute basis. And so here in a few, in a few seconds, we'll see that the delta count drops back down. So delta count's continuing to increase. Now, as we jump into the native app, one of the things I wanna show you is how can you actually find the data streaming for SAP application? If you just click over to the marketplace in your actual Snowflake account, go up to the search button, you search for SAP or SNP, either one of those will pull back and you can see the SNP glue connector for SAP. Now from here, it's a free connector, it's a free add-on for SNP glue. A lot of our contact information is based in here, as well as a tremendous amount of information about the application itself. And from here, you can install and you're good to go and be able to start using it in conjunction with the SAP add-on SNP Glue. I love how you are mixing the best of SAP with the best of Snowflake and making it all work together. Absolutely. It's, it's an exciting application that solves a, a lot of ongoing data integration problems for some of the largest organizations on Earth. Now, for people that want to learn more, where should they go? Absolutely. So uh, first, you can always look me up just on LinkedIn, Benjamin Deaver. Um, second, our corporate website, snpgroup.com. And then third, if you just search for SNP on the Snowflake Marketplace, uh, you'll see in the description for the application, is, for the native application, is all of our corporate contact information. Thanks a lot, Benjamin. No, thank you so much for having me. So find Benjamin on LinkedIn, find SMP Glue on the web or find them on the Snowflake Marketplace. Now, you can see my full conversation with Benjamin on the URL below. And for more developer content, go to developers.snowflake.com and remember to like and subscribe.